Hey guys, it's Danny the Medic. As you may already know, or have figured out by now, when I enjoy something, I don't just, you know, do a little bit of it, I go deep, right? So, with my watch hobby, I actually do things to my watches for fun, right? So, I picked up this, ah, uh, uh, watch toolkit from Amazon. And it's cheap, you know, because I'm a cheap bastard. All right, check it out. All right, guys. So this is the uh, very inexpensive watch tool kit that I got from Amazon. Uh, the link will be in the description below. So the reason I got this is because I purchased some sapphire crystals for my Casio Duro, which I'm going to change these into sapphire. Now, um, according to uh, the internet, I'll be needing a watch crystal press. So I looked into watch crystal presses and like it costs a certain amount of money for the crystal press. But for like 10 bucks more, like the crystal press is included in this huge kit. So I'm like, why not just buy the huge kit? This would be a duplicate of uh, some tools I already have, but why not, you know? So let's check this out. Ah, I'm wearing gloves because this is, I believe this is from China and you don't know what, what's in this box. There we go. Oh, wow. Okay, it's several boxes. Oh, sorry, I thought this was a box. It is not. All right, so I got here a box, a, a some sort of pouch and an instruction manual. Okay. It says, okay, now this thing here is usually like really horrible uh, chemical smelling plastic. So when I say it comes from China, you just gotta watch out for those like plastics where the chemicals smell really bad. So I'm gonna get the garbage can ready in case I encounter one of these again. And last time I got one of these, the color would come off in your hands. Horrible stuff, guys. All right, my garbage can is ready. Okay, let's check this out. What's in here? All right, we got... What is this? Oh, these are the things that you put into here. For this here. Uh... Let me get this out. Watch back opener for screw down backs. And I like this because this is uh, wide enough to do most case bags, right? Whereas my existing tool, let me show you. Uh, it's this one here, which is so small. And this is for like women's watches or something makes it really hard to open up watches I have. So I'm really glad I bought it. So this one I will use for the women's watches and this one I will use for men's watches. Not so bad guys, but let me just smell it. Woo! It smells like it, it needs a washing. Got coated with uh, some sort of caustic oil or something. Right, I'm gonna put it on this towel, which I will throw the towel away later. All right, so it got that. Comes with these little things to go into the holes. This cloth. Hmm, I don't trust this cloth. Into the trash. All right, a uh, case pack tool. Now this is the uh, orange plastic. I'll smell this to make sure it smells okay. If I can ever get this open. It does not smell bad, guys. I'll still air it out for like a month. Oh. Hmm, okay. Trust me guys, if you have not experienced the Chinese plastic smell, you, 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 you would know, dude, it is some really horrible stuff. You don't want to smell it. It's, it's, it's like if you go to the 99 cent store and you get a cheap plastic thing from Asia and you smell it, it's, it's like that, horrifically, Horrible, I don't know, what kind of chemical smell? Okay, let's see how this is. It does not smell bad, guys. Let's see the color comes off.
Okay, I guess this is not one of those bad ones. Although it is really cheap. Right? I, I, I don't recommend, if you don't have one already, this is the bracelet link tool for cotter pins. Right? If you don't have one of these already, do not buy one of these plastic ones. Right? Invest instead in a metal one, such as the one I have here. It is not expensive, guys. So I, I much prefer using one of these. All right. But if you don't have one and you buy this kit, I guess this will do. But in the future, you might want to get the metal one. Here we have a pair of pliers. Uh, sorry, a pair of tweezers. I say the wrong thing sometimes. And here is a case holder, I suppose. Ah. Hmm. All right. I see like uh, you put your watch with the crown here and then you, you know, you screw it tight. And I guess you would just put this entire block onto a, a vise that you have on your bench. And then you can use the appropriate tool to open the case back, I suppose. And it also does not smell too bad. Ah, okay. See, here we have a, uh, this tool here is for spring bars, you know, for your watch bands. And here's like a pushing thing. Cause sometimes watches come with like a uh, holes in the lugs, but you can just push it. So that's a cool thing to have. We got some screwdrivers, a purple, a red and a clear. They are different sizes, small, medium, and large. All right. It looks like pretty much a, a quality driver, right? You hold here, it spins there, right? Over here, I believe it's a, some sort of hex screw for you to, uh, is it a hex screw? I don't know if I even have any hex tools that small. No, I think it's a slotted screwdriver to, uh, for you to, yeah, I think it's slotted. Yeah, to hold on to the bit there. All right, now I wonder what these are. Okay, these are three different sizes of metal bars. What they are used for, I do not yet know. Hmm. Maybe like you use this, right? And this is only so far. And you like, you push it, and then you will use, use this to follow up, and then you push the cotter pin all the way out, maybe? Maybe. Okay, so that's it for this. Well, wow, even the case don't smell so bad. Not bad, guys. All right, so let's see what's inside here. This uh, box. Oh, I didn't need to guess. It says right here, punch needle. Removing pins from a watch. Aha, exactly as I said. Pin link remover. Watch case holder tool. I didn't get this. I got one of these. Hmm. Okay, we got this thing here. Watch case holder, spring bar, three screwdrivers, plastic hammer. Hmm. Huh. Maybe more stuff is in here. Let's see. Ah, yes. So here's this thing. Again, it does not smell bad. I was about to file it clean. Oh my heavens. Okay, the box is empty. Ah, a watch hand removal tool. 
always be careful. Don't scratch your dial, guys, when, when using this thing. You know, put plastic on your dial. Ah, pliers. Wow, dude. I mean, like, for the price, this is, like... Hmm, the, the plastic of the handle smells kind of... kind of bad. We gotta let this one air out. All right, whoo! Check this out. Ha <laughs> uh, ha! Uh, uh, uh. Ow! 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 Wow. Okay, you can mug somebody with this. You go out in the street of New York, you know. Say, hey, give me your wallet. No, I'm not gonna give you my wallet. Okay, I'm so sorry. Wow. All right. So it's a mugging tool. Yep, everything's a mugging tool to us New Yorkers. Here we have a bulb syringe. Okay, I'm gonna smell it, guys. Hmm. It doesn't smell bad. Although this bulb syringe is not as professional looking as my rocket ship style uh, bulb syringe, which, uh, let me see if I have one here. Ah, this is what I normally use. Look at this. Bam. I mean, I guess if you don't have this, you can have this. I have this, I think from photography, I believe. I'm not sure. Photography is another one of my hobbies. All right, so now we have this here press. Ah. Remove that. Oh, so you simply put one on the bottom, put one on top, and you squeeze it straight down. Bam. All right. So there we have it, guys. This is gonna be great. I, I'll, I'll be using this stuff for my upcoming, uh, what is that, the uh, crystal swap. And of course, I also have some existing stuff, such as this here movement holder, you know, which I used to use for something, I, I can't remember what. I also have a bunch of like uh, Rolex style back opening dies here, which I really need to organize. Some stem grease over here. A loop or two. Yeah, stuff guys, stuff. Okay, thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. The link for this set. I mean, it is so cheap to have all this. I think that if you do not have any tools, this would be something to get to start with. I mean, like, wow, guys. This is so good. Mmm. All right. Have a good day, guys.